After finishing a runner-up in World Series of Poker events three times, High Stakes Mixed Game Pro Marco Johnson finally broke through to win the $2,500 Six Max Limit Hold'em event for his first gold bracelet and more than $200,000. Card Player TV caught up with him at his bracelet ceremony to learn more. Yeah, winning a tournament feels really good. Uh, whenever you take second, there's always that like second guessing yourself or doubting every play, like I could have done this, I could have done that, and, and that always sucks because you can't change that. So when you win, it feels really good to just go home satisfied knowing you did everything that you could and there was no better outcome. So it feels great, much better than taking second. Johnson actually finished runner-up in this exact same event in 2012 and undoubtedly had designs to finish the job when he made the final table again this year. Yeah, I mean, uh, that was always on my mind. Uh, I like Limit Hold'em a lot. That's how I started playing poker. It was a really popular game in 2000 to like 2004. That's when I started playing poker, so uh, put a lot of hands in it and feels good to win a bracelet actually in the game that I started playing. So. In Marco's post-win interviews, he mentioned that his decision to become a professional poker player was largely influenced by the late Chip Reese. We asked him if he could explain how the legendary pro inspired him. Well, I started playing when I was young with uh, Chip's nephew, who's my neighbor. And so when we would play, there was like magazine articles on him. And so I'd always kind of read up and, and I could visualize like the dream of like, oh, it's so cool to play poker, but usually that's fantasy. But I could like see somebody doing it, living in a really nice house, really happy and doing what he loved. So it was, it was easy for me to chase that dream being able to visualize it. And so I think that was a big help. And along the way when we started playing, we'd always call him with like funny questions like, uh, would you raise King 10 offsuit here? Would you fold it? And uh, funny stuff, but I think the most that we learned is like the lifestyle, like what it takes to survive in the bigger games and in the poker world because uh, there's a lot of good players that, uh, that have big swings because it's kind of hard to maintain sometimes. Congratulations to Marco Johnson, champion of event 48 at the 2013 World Series of Poker.